Ang video topic po natin yun ay tungkol sa meron sa inlinks that I'll be growing to hydroponics. Sa bandang ulihan po ng video ito, ipapakita ko ang proportions ng mga fertilizer na aking ginamit kung paano ko sila sinukat. Enjoy! I'm now mixing uh, this one and the Epsom salt and the calcium nitrate. Dito sa isang galon, binawas ko na yung tig half cups na para naman sa mixture nito. So this is the procedure. So first, parang sa stop solution pa rin. Dahil 4 liters ang isang galon, actually 3.79. So, so sa 10 liters, divided by uh, 25 so lalabas na 25 by 10 liters so lumalabas sa 2.5 sa isang liter sa 4 liters so lalabas sa 10 ml so 10 ml oh this 10 ml then mix it to the Mix it very thoroughly. What you're hearing is my daughter at the background. Do you know It's a family hobby actually. Kaya lang, it's late at night. Eh. She wants to stay with me. Kaya yan. So after that, um, I'm wrong, sorry. So it's time for drinky. Same ten. Ten. to be sure so mix it with this okay so then from that one gallon I separated itong half cup so ang sunod natin iahalo ang sunod na iahalo next to the mixture step is the Epsom salt one gram okay then Mix mo natin siya dun sa sinetoy kong water. I'm doing this just to be sure na fully dissolve yung ating mga nutrients para walang, mag, walang maging problema sa ating mixture. Kasi nagkakaroon nutrient lang. Iba dyan magkakontra. Hmm. Okay. So, number two is Epsom salt. Okay. Epsom salt. Checking it. Fully dissolved. Okay. Then, putting it into our mixture. Yan. The last one is the calcium nitrate. 2 grams. 1 gram yung Epsom salt, 2 grams yung calcium nitrate.
Sensyon na hukot, maingay yung aking anak She's very happy to be with us With me, working Fortunately, this is fertilizer Kaya hindi siya pwede rito Last is the calcium nitrate. Hindi po pwedeng pagbalibalik ta rin ang ating procedure na mixture. Ano po? Should be followed strictly with the letter by the number. So, mix it again thoroughly. And to avoid your accidents, incidents, I will label this. This is for the vegetative. Okay. Nice po itong 7 liter mineral water container. At ito na po yung ating solution. So, lalagyan ko po itong water. So ito ay gagamitin ko po para takpan lang po ito sa araw kasi lalagay ko po siya outdoors. So para maiwasan po yung pagtubo ng algae ng gumot pag naarawan po siya. At ito naman po yung magiging board niya, floater. At ito po yung aking candidate. is a melon seedling. So ang papansin niyo dito ko po siya hinarden for almost 3 to 4 days na. Simula ng transplanting. Ayan, may meron na po siyang tumutubong mga roots underneath so ang gagawin ko lang po ay tanggalin siya rito sa styro at ipapasok po siya rito sa panibago be sure na ho hindi nyo po may ipit yung ibang ugat na tumutubo tapos just enough for it to touch the water yan yan so, putting it inside this. So, that's it. Lagay na po natin siya sa kanya. Ito po ang aking ginamit na timbangan dahil wala po tayong digital uh, weighing scale. So, just to explain, ito po ay isang 1 centavo ng Philippine coin, yung pinakabago. Uh, at ang weight po niya is 1.9 grams. So, ang kailangan ko po ay 2 grams ng ating fertilizer. So, I'm using this counterweight more or less. 
And to correct po kung talagang tama yung calibration ko sa ating improvised digital scale. So, yan. Pinaglagay ko po yung isang 1 centavo coin sa kabila at okay naman po. Uh, they're equal. So, ibig sabihin, tama po yung aking, more or less, close yung aking pag-weight. Yan. Sato. Okay. That is also 2 grams of this. It's calcium nitrate. And now the Epsom salt I divide it to 2. Okay na rin. <laughs> 